Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Our next guest made his debut in the 90s with the classic hit, This Is How We Do It. Since then, he's given us hit after hit after hit. Now he is embarked on a spiritual journey with his wife by moving into the gospel industry. And he's co-authored a new relationship book entitled This Is How We Do It, Making Your Marriage a Masterpiece. Yes. Please welcome Montel and Kristen Jordan. Yes. What's up, family? Yes. They look so good. Don't they not so cute? And, and oh, guess you. what? They're, they're grandparents. Yeah. <gasps> yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, how do we say it? Wait. Grandparents? I'm a Mimi. Oh, I'm oh, sorry. Mimi. Mimi. And I'm and Big what? Papa. Big Papa Big and Papa. Mimi. Oh, yeah, I love it too, when yo. they call me Big Papa. Right. <laughs> <laughs> how does that feel? Uh, it's amazing. Yes. Can I tell you, he is by far the most handsome young yeah. man that's Look ever cruise. walked this planet. Wow. So, yeah. yep. and and another one on the way. Bear. And another one on the way. We have in another January. one in January. <gasps> yes, y'all are busy. You got to do it right. Yes. You guys have obviously been doing it right. You've been married for 20 plus years. Years. Yeah. Did you ever think that when years. It, did yeah. you think it would endure the test of time like this? Um, you know, you you always think that yes, when you, you start, hope, but hope then a, as you go through journeys in life, you realize I don't I don't know if we're gonna make it. Some yeah. people think that when they start. That's Some right. people go into marriage with an exit strategy rather than an eternal strategy. Oh, that's wow. correct. Yeah, that's so true. we have been married now for 25 years to each other. Yes. yes. Got to say that. Want to say yes. that? Yes. Uh, Amen. So and, and it's been a uh, it's been a journey. We basically we we understand we're going to be married to each other happily together forever. Right. Right yes. now. Yes. And uh, we want other people to be able to understand that they can say that too. Because normally when you say a statement like that, it's kind of like this. Uh, mm -hmm. How do you know? Right. Sure. Sure. Eh, and so, but but we know without shadow of a doubt. Right. And you had to to get to this certain mm -hmm. place, obviously in your marriage. You know, I'm married for 17 years. I know you. It's undulations. It's up and down. Mm -hmm. And you know, you're having a favorite husband how did that put a strain on the relationship it's been well documented in so many yeah. you know different places you you went through a lot went through a lot well you know what actually when we first started um, I was his manager mm -hmm. and so oh, wow. the record label told us that if I wanted to be successful in business that I didn't want to say that I was married so I was like oh yeah okay I got this mm -hmm. I want to be successful in business but the yeah. thing was is that I totally set myself up and so it made everything a lot more awkward as far as because when we were in public people didn't know we were married oh, my gosh. Oh, wow. in fact we it, it this lasted for years until one day we were on the <laughs> red, carpet red carpet at MTV somewhere. At MTV Movie Awards, and he was like, Wait, and this is my wife. wife. I was like, you out of me. You out of me. The gig is over. Yeah. yeah. But no, it was, uh, you know, if, you know, success in the business is, you know, if men want to uh, be you and women want to be with you, mm -hmm. you can be successful. And so yes. we kind of bit into that, yeah. and we had. Uh, and it worked. Yeah. We had guys that wanted to, to be me or be around me, women mm -hmm. that wanted to be with me, mm -hmm. but then we started to live those things out in real life. Yeah. yeah so Detrimental. Why, yeah, why yeah. was it so important for you all to write this book? Um, for yeah. us, we wanted to make sure that people knew how to overcome yes. the things that we've had to endure. Truthfully, where we get raw and really real and tell people, listen, these are the roads that you don't have to travel down mm -hmm. yeah. because we've already been there. Yeah, yeah. And, and, a, and a lot of people don't necessarily understand that what we've been through is something that God allowed to mm -hmm. be able to happen, That's but true. not just for us. If we don't tell the story, it's just a bunch it's of yucky helping, stuff exactly. that, yeah. that happened, but we're able to tell uh, somebody else, if you want to know what lies down a certain road, uh, you can look back to somebody that's willing to be transparent with you and hey, let you know, you know yeah. what we've seen. Wow, we're going to have more with this amazing, amazingly beautiful couple yes. when we return. Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. The Jordans are still on the couch with us, and they've gone from ministry through song to ministering to marriages with their new book. Yes, the masterpiece. Yes. Yeah. But I love the play on word, master. Peace, P-E-A-C-E. -E. Yes. Talk to us about that and what it means to actually conquer peace in a marriage. Yeah. Well, I, I think that life in general is just, we look at it as like a big puzzle. You know, how do I balance my, you know, my career, my family, my personal time, all those different things, a lot of pieces. And we have found that marriage for us has been the masterpiece to that mm -hmm. puzzle, mm -hmm. not just for those who are married, for those who desire to be married. And so we figured when you can master that piece, you can master peace uh, in your life. And so that's what we have tried to do and explain to everybody else. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. And when we keep those priorities in alignment, mm -hmm. that's how peace comes yes. and remains. Uh -huh. yes. yes. And you've also turned this book into a conference. Tell we us about have. that. Yeah. It's, um, we do um, 
conference uh, topics and we do a date night mm -hmm. on Friday mm -hmm. night. Yes. Yeah, yes. have a little uh, fun and basically mm -hmm. teach you fundamentals and principles to have a real life marriage that's successful. Yeah, the music business has given us great outlets, not just to be able to function in the church to do events to help yeah. marriages, but just to help people in general with their marriages and with their relationships. Yeah. And so the date nights, the conferences, uh, speaking engagements, all of those things are under Marriage Masterpiece. Saving marriages, yes. thank you God. Yes. 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 But I, I'm about to be a newlywed. So is this book just for married couples? No, actually it's for singles as well. If you desire to be married, yeah. it's basically to show you the things. One of the chapters we talk about is myth busters of things that, Ooh. of different things that we thought were Going real, in, yeah. not real. Yeah. Like yeah. what? Yeah, I want to know. Give us one. Do you, can you give us one? So, um, you, you're always looking for Mr. Right, and the truth is, is you were never supposed to be looking at all. Right. He's supposed to find you, and he might be right now, but you want him to be mm -hmm. all the way fixed and have God um, to turn the situation around before you actually get a hold of him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Where oh. I find him? Where I'm gonna find him? You ain't supposed to find, find him. him. He's, He's gonna find you. you. Oh, he tell me. <laughs> right. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what's I hear about this duet? You were all singing together. Oh, yeah. Man. New album. Yeah. Uh, after over ten years. Good for wow. you. Yeah. Masterpiece. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. yeah. Uh, new album called Masterpiece. It drops on uh, Black Friday. Nice. I'm, I'm black every Friday, so I don't see what the big deal is. But we wanted this to make guy. a big deal out of it, so we put together an album, and the album features ten new songs, on these nice. songs, from the heart of a man that loves God, loves his wife, loves his kids. And That's she and I, after 25 years of marriage, we have finally did a duet together. That is so cute. Oh, what was that yeah. like for you, Kristen? Gotta okay, know. so <laughs> the crazy part is, is that when Monta and I first got together, I was the artist. He was the producer. What? Yeah. Shut the front door. Yeah, I was, in a, I was oh in a girls God. group. Yeah. yeah. A girls, girl. girl. Yep. And yeah. then we would do these. We would do these conferences and these talent shows. Talent and shows. Stuff. And he would win. I was like, okay, I'm on the wrong side of this. Right. I got to do this. Yeah. 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 Oh, that's super. Fun. So that's how I became management. Yeah. Like that. I and so this was the, a long hear. time coming. I know. Yeah. But it's called I'm All In. Yeah. Oh, yes. It's a great song. Yeah. It's a great okay. song. I love it. Are you going to incorporate any praise and worship at all? Just real quick. It is a different type of praise and worship because I praise and worship in church, mm -hmm. but I also, I get to praise God and I get to worship him when I love my wife properly. Oh, I'm wow. excited. I can't wait. Montel, Kristen, thank you guys so thank much for coming so by. Thank you so much. Always Goodness. welcome. Be sure to pick up This Is How We Do It, Making Your Marriage a Masterpiece by heading over to the website montelandkristen.com.